Hello, y'all. Um, it's now 6.56 p.m. These next door neighbors right here, um, after I just did a video for YouTube, it was too long for TikTok. And um, right after I did the video, they started to make a noise that's uh, like noise harassment and make a noise that sounds like as if they're bouncing a ball or something. Um, you know, noise harassment with that tapping, and it sounds like they're bouncing the ball. So I have some news. I hope this video does not get suppressed. Um, this is the TikTok 10 minute or less shorter version because I can't do go more than 10 minutes. So I'm homeless here in um Cincinnati, Ohio. I found out I get social security and I found out about this place in Texas. You hear the thumping? So I found out about this place in Texas. Um, that's the gang stalking neighbors right next door. So um, I, I found out about this place in Texas that's $540 a month with no credit check and no security deposit, all utilities paid if you get a social security check. So, um, so that $540 a month place, I have the information in the description part, you know, of my Venmo cash app or fundraiser or, um, PayPal on ways y'all can support and help me out within, you know, before tomorrow night. So I need help with, um, well, I got the social security check. So the $540, I should be able to pay on my own probably, or I may need a little help with that. But I also need help with a few hundred dollars if multiple people can pitch in. Um, I need help with a few hundred dollars for Greyhound bus transportation. As soon as y'all see this video, y'all can look at the little description. You know, I I'm trying to get assistance to travel down there to Texas. And that could be a permanent place for me to live off the streets. No lease and um, no credit check, no deposit, and all utilities paid $540 a month and, and plus a $35 one-time application fee. So, um, you know, with, I'm trying to get help within the next 24 hours. <clears throat> um. And I know the gang stalkers, they be trying to sabotage. They're so evil. But I know, I, I mean, the gang stalkers, they, 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 you know, they're so evil and stuff like that. So, um, so I, I'm, I'm trying to get the word out. Come on, man, stop. So, um, you know, if I can you know, get out of here the day after tomorrow and go travel to Texas um, on Greyhound bus because I don't know what's going on with the TSA and, and flying. I'm, as much as I love flying on airplanes, um, I, I don't know. I, I mean, I don't know how hectic it is. You know, I would hate to... I mean, I don't even know if which would be cheaper would would it be cheaper to fly or would it be cheaper to take the Greyhound bus? I don't have a car. <clears throat> so I don't know if it'd be cheaper to fly or 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 take a um fly on a plane or take a bus, but I figure I'm too fat for, to fly on a dog on airplane. So I got no choice but to take the dog on Greyhound bus. So anything y'all can help me out with you know, multiple people can pitch in and help me out with, um, 
you know, the transportation to get down there and maybe some food and stuff like that. Because I have bills to pay, too, despite being homeless. I got my storage bill and my phone bill. And my storage bill is over $100 a month, like almost 117 a month. And then, you know, after I get settled, if I get the help to get down there and after I get settled, I can try to, um, you know, after I get settled and comfortable, then maybe I can go back to Pensacola and go get my stuff out of the storage unit and get rid of the storage unit and then bring my stuff to my new home. So, um, as I said, I had the information in the description box, um, of ways y'all can help if PayPal, Venmo, Cash App, and, um, my fundraiser, which will go to the PayPal and, um, or y'all can support my Kofi with my writings. And I said that with me being targeted, if I can get this permanent place to live or any permanent place to live, I said I would try as best as I could to not let them make me back homeless again. I would try to not let them make me back homeless again. It's been a rough, um, wow, if I would have been like way to, um, throughout this July or August has still been, I would have been, it would have been like, I would have been homeless for five years. Before then, that the longest I ever been homeless was nine days. And then struggling now, struggling for years being homeless and stuff like that. So I know y'all going to be sick and tired of me begging. I, I mean, y'all be glad I won't, I probably won't be begging, you know, that much, but that's what homeless poor people do. So I don't know why people want to say, well, oh, well, um, real homeless people don't beg. Where y'all get that from? Not every homeless person. See, you, you hear what that you hear it? Stop. So, um, so I'm an author. I write short stories. If I had um, that permanent place to live in a, a cooking facility. I can try to do cooking videos and stop. I can, I can try to do cooking videos and I can, um, write cookbook, write and publish cookbooks. And also, um, I can, I can write and publish cookbooks and I can, um, write and publish more short stories and more eBooks. And, you know, I can be off the streets and be able to concentrate and focus better. Um, but you know, um, even if I had a permanent place to live, that's not going to shut me up on exposing their tactics of, of their torment towards and what they're doing towards me with the gang stalking and all that, you know? So, um, I know a lot, the majority of the professed targeted individual community have sold out and they all hate me and banded together against me. So, um, it's very sad. Even the ones that say that they're, that they're Christian, if they feel like, Oh, you burned your bridges and they got their nose turned up and they won't even help. And they tell everybody just like the perps do and say, do not help her. She, you know, <clears throat> so, um, a real chosen one you wouldn't be doing that. I'm going through this, I'm going through this targeting my damn self and I don't perp anybody at all, you know? So, um, they'll either try to prevent, hinder or sabotage, or once you get it, they'll try to har harass and terrorize and torture you to the point where you, you know, the, the online perps, if they make threats to, oh, I'm going to get your job taken away, they'll also make threats to, oh, I'm going I'm to make sure you lose your place to live and stuff like that. But, you know, I know I need to pray and, I, you know, I would like for others to pray heavy for me. So please help me out within 24 hours of, um you know, my 10 minutes is just about up. So thanks in advance for any help. And please spread the word. 
Bon, mais...